the great silence. And, and it's a tremendous mystery, as I said earlier, but it does seem that the universe is quiet as far as we can tell. Is it possible that we're looking for something that is not applicable to this particular type of civilization? Yeah, there are different. So the count, counter arguments, when we say we've seen nothing, therefore, as far as we can tell, there's nothing out there. You could say, well, um, what if the civilization that evolved is far ahead of us? What if the space probes are the size of an iPhone? <laughs> right. Well, well, it's kind of a reasonable thing to say, actually. Because sure. Why would you not, if you can build a little thing, that, right. that it's easier to send around the galaxy than a big thing. Yeah. So why would you not, as you said, these hyper, ultra intelligent quantum computers, why would they not be tiny? Right. So you could say that. So you could say, well, that maybe they are. Maybe they're all over the solar system, but they're the size of phones and we wouldn't have seen them. And mm. that, so, yeah. <laughs> so it, it, it becomes a powerful question. Why does it appear that nobody's done that? And my guess, in the absence of other evidence, would be biology. It's just that maybe the number of places where biology becomes complex enough to do that mm. is, is on average one, maybe on average zero per galaxy. Right? Maybe right. just civilizations are very, very, very rare in the universe.